Life is very precious, and it is really devastating to hear young people wishing they could just die because they are going through a tough time in their lives. It is easy to say that all of the time as a means of letting out your curbed pain, but if you are in a sea and you are drowning, you will struggle hard to stay alive and hope someone saves you. Life could end in an instant, and today's story reveals unbearable pain and how fate could not be overcome. Today's story is about a mom sat down on a haystack and made the biggest mistake of her life. But before we start, please make sure to subscribe to Did You Know and hit the bell so you never miss an upload from us. Also, leave a like right now. Fate plays a very big role in determining our lives and how things go. Death could hit you at any moment anywhere, even if you are totally safe and secured. Kaylin Rowland was a young mother to two children and had a happy family until her mother's death came to break her heart and end her life as well. The thing is, agony and mourning did not kill Kaylin. What killed her was something far insignificant and hardly noticed. It is such a sad story and our hearts go out to the husband and the young kids. After one day when Kaylin's mother passed away, she went out of her house to catch some fresh air and calm down a little bit. While she was making a phone call, she casually sat down and then she figured out she sat on a haystack and that was the worst mistake she had ever made in her entire life. You will now know why. She lived in Selma, Alabama, and the weather was scorching hot. It was really sunny out there, and planning for her mother's funeral took a long time, so she wanted to take a moment out there to make her phone call as quickly as possible and get back to her children, who were two and seven years old. However, it was too late for her to see her children again, and she died out there in her husband's arms. What a tragic thing. WSFA mentioned that the mother realized that there was something wrong when she sat down on the haystack because she got attacked by fire ants. She screamed very loud, but unfortunately it was too late to do something about it because Kaylin was already allergic to ants and had an anaphylactic reaction to the ants' bites. Therefore, it was really fatal and not insignificant at all, though the insects were really insignificant. Her body started to swell and she could not breathe because of her allergy to ants in general. Sheila Rowland talked to a local news station about the tragic death and how she was very devastated to see her son carrying all that pain in his heart. She said that losing a mother and a daughter in one day was unbearable pain and too much for one person to take on. She explained that the ants kept attacking her and getting all over Kaylin's body. Her husband tried to save her, but he could not, and she deliberately could not breathe and immediately died. Roland's heart was broken and wished she could soothe her son's pain, who lost his wife and his mother-in-law at the same time. They held a funeral for Kaylin and her mother, and her children were there to say their last goodbye to their mom and their grandma. Sheila started a GoFundMe after the funeral in order to give the poor, devastated family some help and encourage people to stand by their sides and help the husband with his two young boys. Accidents like this one in Alabama were very rare to even detect. Not even a single person was killed by an ant in the years 2013, 2014, and 2015. Well, that story was just heartbreaking by all means. We offer our condolences to the father and the young precious boys for losing their mom and their grandmother. We will never forget them in our prayers and ask God to give the husband and the children the strength to endure that pain of loss. May their souls rest in peace. When all is said and done, we are predestined and fate controls our lives. Life is really precious, so do not take it for granted. Enjoy every moment and live your life to the max because death comes when it is never expected and you cannot trick it nor escape it. Make sure your life is worthwhile and create a lot of good memories. You only live once.